What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Gaining Grounds. I've got another product review today. It is Natural Vitality Calm. This is an anti-stress drink mix. It's a uh, vegan, verified, non-GMO, magnesium dietary supplement. So um, on this new regimen, I've really been struggling with the number twos. And I uh, reached out to my sister and her fiance to find out what they do to uh, keep them regulated while they're living that macro life. Um, I was looking at probiotics, digestive enzymes, all that other fun crap. And uh, those two things seem to be for people who were constantly in a lot of pain. And I haven't really been. I just haven't been regular. So uh, they told me to look into this stuff and they take it every night. Um, and supposedly it gives you great sleep. It relaxes you, de-stresses you. I don't know if any of that's true. I just want to empty out. So uh, you're supposed to take one scoop, which is four grams, and you're supposed to mix it into uh, some hot water. So it says two to three ounces of hot water. Let it, fig let it fizz. Um, once it finishes fizzing, you mix it till it's dissolved, and then you top it off with either warm water or cold water. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and try this. Um, it says you should start with a smaller dose, but I like living on the edge. I'm going to go with the full four grams. I'm going to uh, mix it. I got hot water going on the kettle behind me. I'm going to uh, do the fizz dissolve and then I'm going to add cold water on top of it because I don't really, I don't know if I'm going to like it and I don't think I want to sip it if it's hot, but if it's cold, I'll be able to chuck it down quick. So um, I'm going to go ahead, wait for my water to boil, mix this up, throw some cold water, then I'll be back. I'll try, the, I'll try it on video, and then I'll probably come back in the morning and finish this review with how I slept. And uh, hopefully, if the magnesium kicked in without giving you too much detail. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and uh, wait for my water to go, mix this up, and I'll be back. All right, so really quick, I um, added hot water and I put the potter in and then I added hot water and it got really fizzy. The, um, it kind of looked like Alka-Seltzer. Alka-Seltzer. Doesn't really smell like anything. What I forgot to mention was that it does have a flavor. It's a natural raspberry lemon with other natural flavors, of course. Um, I don't see caloric content on here. Um, it just has that... One scoop, four grams, uh, is 325 grams, uh, milligrams of magnesium um, as magnesium carbonate, but there's nothing else on it. The ingredients are citric acid, organic natural flavors, organic stevia leaf extract. Uh, no yeast, dairy, egg, soy, wheat, sugar, fructose, starch, preservatives, or artificial color or flavor. So yeah, so um, it doesn't smell like it, but it's supposed to taste like natural lemon, natural raspberry lemon. So what I'm gonna do, is um, I just mix it up. I'm gonna go add cold water, probably halfway up to the mug, and we're just gonna drink it and see what happens overnight. So let me add the cold water and I'll be back for a taste test. All right, I'm back. I um, added some cold water. I didn't really measure it. I just went to the fridge dispenser and took some from there. Um, I did read somewhere you don't have to just drink it. You can uh, add it to, well, it says you can add it to a glass or a bottle of cold water if you don't want to do the boiling water first. Um, for best results, you should divide your daily amount into two or three servings. I, I don't have time for that. Uh, so yeah, so I guess you can put this directly into a bottle of cold water. So I don't know what the point of, the point of it is to boil. Uh, they should just say that as the directions, put it in cold water or whatever. I don't know. So here it is, I'm gonna try it. It tastes, it smells like water with a hint of berry. It kinda tastes like Alka-Seltzer without the fizz. Has a little bit of a chalky taste. I mean, the water's clear, it's not fizzy anymore but it kind of tastes like um, when you're chewing on Tums, when you swallow Tums and, um, or any kind of anti-acid tablet, when you swallow it, the chalky aftertaste you get after, that's kind of what you get with this. 
like I said, it's not horrible. Is it the best thing I want to drink? No. Do I feel you drinking it? No. But does my gut need to be emptied? Yes. So, cheers. I'm a regular water person. I like ice cold plain water. So, uh, this isn't bad. I know I'm making a face, but it's just because I don't like flavored water. I don't like um, any of those ice waters or whatever they're called. I just like plain flavored water. Lots of ice, so cold that it gives me a toothache. That's the kind of water I like. So this is like warm water with a hint of berry. So I think next time I might just put it in a bottle of uh, cold water from the fridge and try that. But I mean, like I said, it's not horrible. If it works, it'll be great. Again, I don't know about this anti-stress claim it's making or if I'm going to sleep the, my best sleep ever, which I don't really have an issue with sleeping. My sister said she gets the best sleep she's ever had. I'm just hoping for some production in the morning if you get my drift. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this. I'm not going to bore you guys. Uh, when I come back, it'll be tomorrow morning. And I'll let you know what happened with as little details as possible. So uh, cheers. All right. It is morning number one. I took this stuff last night. Um, I slept okay. I had to get up super early today for a work call. So it was really hard to gauge how well I really slept because I think I only got like five hours, maybe six, thanks to that call. Did go to the restroom. It wasn't the greatest, but it's better than what it has been. So I'm going to uh, give this a couple more days before I put together an official review. So yeah, um, I will have morning two next. All right, this is an update for morning number two uh, using the Calm Magnesium Anti-Anxiety Stress Relief Drink. Um, again, I slept well last night, but I don't usually have an issue with sleeping. I was taking this more for other digestive issues, if you get my drift. Yesterday morning was a lovely morning for digestive issues. Today hasn't really, I haven't noticed an effect on um, my body and those issues. So... Um, yeah, is it doing anything? I don't know. So I'm going to continue this uh, video going for a few more days and uh, maybe a week. And then I'll upload um, what I think of the product after a week. So again, this is morning number two. And uh, right after this, you'll see morning number three. Hey, everybody. Uh, morning number three was productive. Um, so when I first took... The drink on night one, sorry for the finger, I followed the exact instructions of boiling hot water, letting it fizz, letting it cool down, mix, not cool down, letting the fizz stop, mixing it, and then adding cold water on top. I did read a suggested other use could be to use uh, just cold water. So the second night I mixed it with just cold water, I drank it. So I'm starting to wonder if mixing with the hot water, the fizziness, if that activates it better, I don't know. So for the rest of this, experiment for the week. I'm just going to uh, mix it with the boiling water and let it fizz and drink it the way I drank night one and night three because day two and day four were um, very good. So we'll see what happens. I'll let you know. Stay tuned. All right. Quick update. Morning number four uh, using the Vitality Calm Magnesium Anti-Stress Powder successful morning on the porcelain throne so that's two days in a row so i'm starting to wonder if boiling the water first does make a difference uh, so i'm going to continue doing that for the rest of the week boiling the water adding it to four grams of the powder letting it fizz once fizz is done mixing it completely and then i add a bunch of cold water on top unmeasured and then i just drink it so as far as sleep again i don't really have problems sleeping but i have noticed last couple nights i've been waking up uh, when I wake up, I should say, uh, to like roll over or go to the restroom, whatever. Super groggy. I feel like I've taken an antihistamine. So it's weird. But when I get up in the morning, I don't have the same effect that I get when I take like a PM pill or an antihistamine. So it's like taking one of those without the morning effects. So maybe it is helping me sleep. I don't know. So I'll keep an eye on that for the rest of the week as well. So yeah, that's it for morning number four. We'll see what happens tomorrow. Hey, what's going on everybody? Uh, morning five update using Nature's Vitality Calm Magnesium Anti-Stress 
make you poo drink. Um, I mean, I woke up this morning and I went. So after a month of struggling on this new diet of struggling with, you know, blockage, I guess, on this new diet, it seems to be working. I don't know if it's a coincidence. Uh, my sleep again is, is the same as I mentioned in the last video. I wake up in the middle of the night to roll over, go to the restroom and I'm pretty groggy. Feels like I took an antihistamine, but I didn't. But when I wake up in the morning to actually get going, I feel great. I don't have that grogginess that I get. I'm taking like a PM pill or an antihistamine pill. So yeah, um, the magnesium seems to be doing its thing down below. And um, I think it's helping me sleep. I'm assuming all of this is because of that. I don't want to get off it to test it because I had such a rough month with the bathroom. So uh, yeah, so that's morning five. We're going to do another two mornings and see if this trend continues. And um that's it. I'll see you morning six. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Uh, it's day six. It's not morning six. My morning was way too busy today to get a video done. So yeah, it is uh, day six. Again, great morning if you get my drift. Um, same kind of sleep where I'll get up in the middle of the night and I just feel like I took an antihistamine or a, like a sleep aid. But I wake up feeling fine. This morning sucked, though, because I had to get up at 5.30. Uh, to uh, take my dad somewhere um, for a procedure, nothing serious. And I ended up waking up at three and then I tossed and turned till 3.45, just kind of tired, but not able to fall asleep. And then I passed out at five just to wake up 30 minutes later. So that was awesome. So um, I think it's helping with sleep. I think it's helping with everything else uh, that I, my digestive issues I've been having because I've been pretty regular and January was not a regular month. So yeah, tomorrow's the last day. Um, I'll do one last video and then I'll do an overall update on my thoughts on the product. And then, um, yeah, that'll be it. So we'll, uh, we'll see what happens to day seven. Hey, what's going on everybody? It is night number seven. I have taken natural vitality calm for seven nights and I've experienced seven mornings with it. Um, I wanted to give you my final thoughts when I started uh, macro counting my body just stopped down there. Um, I don't know why I was eating my recommended amount of fiber, but I noticed whenever I change eating habits, it takes me a long time to get regular. Um, when I eat junk food, it just flows right through me. But when I eat healthy food, unprocessed food, clean food, my body just would go days. It went days in January without me going to the restroom. So my sister, if I had, as I had said earlier, had recommended this magnesium supplement powder, uh, Natural Vitality Calm Anti-Stress Drink Mix. Here's my experience. So uh, you've seen my updates each, each morning. Um, one night, I think I messed up. It does say that you can do, uh, it does recommend you do boiling water and then you can add cold water to it. But it also says you can also simply add it to a glass of, or bottle of cold water. I did that on night two. Day morning three, or I guess it's morning two, sorry. Morning two was the only morning I did not go. So morning one, morning three, four, five, six, and seven, success, went every morning. And that's probably the most I'd gone in the month of January. So I don't know if adding the hot water to it and getting the fizz action um, made a difference, but it seems to work and my sleep also I mentioned I've been I've been getting some good sleep I've been getting some antihistamine PM medication sleep without the antihistamine PM medication hangover in the morning I'll get up at 2 in the morning to roll over or go to the restroom or whatever and my eyes are just heavy like I go lay right back down or I roll over and I'm out again it's fantastic and is it this stuff or is it a coincidence I don't know, but I, I'm doing so good. I'm going to assume it's this stuff and I'm going to keep taking it. So I got this at uh, my local BJ's Wholesale Club. It was $24.99. It was a coupon for $7 off. I got it for, uh, I can't do math, $17.99. Now it's four grams. There's 142 servings in here. So uh, you get about four, five months, uh, maybe four and a half months of my math sucks. Uh, let's see, 30, 60, 90, 120. 150. So yeah, you get almost five months worth. So I don't think the price is that bad for even if I paid full price 24.99, especially for how I've been feeling. 
Um, you know, it's, it's raw, it's clean, none of that matters to me, but they do put that on the back, raw and clean, good for you. I'm getting regular, I'm sleeping good, so I'm gonna go ahead and assume that, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and assume that this thing works. It's working for me, so I'm curious. Um, you can get this off, of, off Amazon if you can't find it at a local store. I'd love to know if you tried it. I've asked a couple friends who have tried it. One says it did nothing for her. The other one said it actually helped her father's uh, Parkinson shakes. So yeah, I mean, I'm taking the full dose at night. It says you can space it throughout the day. I'm doing all four grams about an hour before I go to bed and so far so good. So yeah, if you've tried this, uh, please let me know in the comments down below if it did anything for you um, or if I'm just experiencing kind of placebo effect or if it's just a coincidence and I'm getting lucky and my body's finally regular. But normally most tests, you would take something and then stop taking it and you would see if there'd be a difference, but I don't want to risk I don't want to risk that. I'm going to assume this is working because I'm feeling good. So I'm not going to risk not taking it. And then I'm stopped up again. Like I said, my sleep was never really an issue. So, you know, being groggy, super tired. Um, I don't really care about that. Yeah, it's good deep sleep, but my sleep never really suffered. But yeah, the bathroom issue, it's been wonderful. And, you know, magnesium is supposed to help with that. So I'm sure it's related. But yeah, if you've tried this, please let me know in the comments. And as always, if you have not yet subscribed to this video, what are you waiting for? You can do so now by clicking on the big old red subscribe button down below. Clicking on the bell next to it will alert you every time I upload new content about me and my bathroom habits. Wrong way. Me and my bathroom habits. Um, like this video, give it a thumbs up. It helps my channel grow. And when my channel grows, you get to see me and more of my bathroom habits. And of course, feel free to share this uh, video on social media. You might reach somebody who uh, doesn't know about this product and maybe they're having the same issues I was having and they want to go ahead and try it out. And of course, I've got other videos you can share. Uh, you might inspire somebody out there who wants to start their own weight loss journey and maybe they just don't know how. And watching these videos might inspire them because if I can do this for almost a month now, anybody can do it. So yeah, uh, that's my review of uh, Natural Vitality Calm. I think I called it Nature's Vitality one morning. Just ignore that. It's Natural Vitality Calm. I'll put a link down below to the website. And let me know what you think. So yeah, thanks for watching. I appreciate the support.